Going back to having spent over 30 years now in England, one day you just wake up and you realize you're still a foreigner in a foreign land. And roots, I mean, something I had never thought about, grab you. And I realized that I was in search of something that was, would take me back to my native Brazil. It would take me back to, in fact, roots that I probably didn't even understand because even in my own family, there are direct connections with the Indians in the Amazon, dating back to my great-great-great-grandfather, who actually married the daughter of an Indian chief. Um, almost a Pocahontas-type story, which is quite, quite amusing. That was a moment, a very critical moment for me in my work, because it all changed. Having been very influenced probably much more by European trends and things, I felt that it was time that I did something to recapture, uh, especially on a, on a cultural sense, things that are disappearing very quickly um, in, our, in my country, especially in the Amazon region. I've always had this, this interest in the ecological um, problems that we are facing and the fact that Brazil still had a chance to preserve so much, um, whereas other countries had already destroyed so much. It seemed to me that whatever little or big or whatever that I could do to um, get a message across that this is happening. Um, I didn't want a, a political collection. I really wanted something that was connected directly to the Indians in the Amazon who were losing their culture. I mean, it, was, it really came down to a day that I saw amongst pottery and things that I used to collect. Um, I visited the Indian Museum in Rio and they had some pottery there, which in fact, I was completely appalled because it had the face of Mickey Mouse on one of these pieces of pottery. And I thought, this is just absolutely outrageous. I mean, not only are the lands being taken, they're being massacred, but their whole culture is eroding as well. And, you know, all of us have to do our little part in trying to rescue some of this heritage. So yes, I, that's when I started to get very interested in doing something with the uh, culture that we still have from the Amazonian Indians.